Does using Wi-Fi lower computer noise? Well, this question comes from Jivan Deep Singh in Hong Kong, and he writes, Hi, Paul. In my present setup, I'm using music stored on a MacBook Pro with Otterfana program to stream to Chord Poly Mojo on Wi-Fi mode. No wires are connected. So uh, for those that don't know, Chord is a, a British company that makes some great products, and, and they, um, they have one called the Poly Mojo, which is a, like a DAC. Um, my, my query is if the electronic noise of the laptop is being transferred to the cord polymojo? And the answer is no. So Wi-Fi is, uh, is a really good way to stream music without having it connected to a computer. Typically, a DAC is connected up through USB. And USB is a fairly noisy two-way communication line that isn't the best. It's probably my least favorite of all the ways to get uh, music in out of a computer and into a DAC because of the noise issues and there's like we we go to great lengths to try and isolate that noise as best we can because computers are noisy for sure. So you can um, use Ethernet, you can use Wi-Fi, um, what else can you can you use? Uh, in some cases, you can use an optical cable, but that's fairly rare. So yeah, I mean, Wi-Fi has its limitations, but almost uh, most of them are speed. But for uh, audio, uh, I mean, you can do video on Wi-Fi. So an audio is far less bandwidth than than video. Now, there's a lot of people that will argue that it doesn't sound as good, but I have never found that to be the case. And I think Wi-Fi is a terrific way of transferring digital audio data from the noisy environment of a computer to the quiet, hopefully quiet environment of a DAC. So yeah, I think you're doing exactly the right thing. And I would encourage others not to be so afraid of using Wi-Fi. Even if it's a, sometimes people use a, an ethernet bridge if you don't know what those are, it's a Wi-Fi connected Ethernet um, device. So at one end you have a, 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 a router uh, and at the other end you have this box that is connected via Wi-Fi and it converts the signal, the Wi-Fi signal, into an Ethernet compatible output which then can go into your DAC and that's just another step. But if your DAC doesn't have Wi-Fi, then you can use an Ethernet bridge. And they work great. I, I, I use one at my home. Works great. So, Okay, thanks for the question. Talk to you tomorrow.